Um, so I am just in the middle of editing the video that you guys are about to watch and I realised that because I'm a silly billy I forgot to film the intro so this is kind of like the intro I guess. Um, in this tutorial we're going to make this little um, Easter bunny plush and it is holding an Easter egg and the Easter egg comes out like this. So yeah that's kind of cute I think. Um, I actually filmed this tutorial yesterday because I finished college at 1 o'clock which is like three hours usually I can't speak three hours earlier than I usually finish so I thought as soon as I had a little bit of time I could make a plush tutorial for you guys um, I'm gonna film again on Friday so I should have another video up on Saturday I hope um, but yeah for now watch this video I'm sorry I rumble too much <laughs> thank you bye for this tutorial you will need white black and pink felt white black and pink thread the template which you can download in the video description, a sewing needle and fabric scissors. Trace around the fabric onto white felt. Now fold the felt in half and cut out the shape. You should get two identical pieces. We also need to cut out two ear pieces, two feet pieces, a white circle for the tail and two arm pieces. I included my template for the arms but for the other pieces you can just cut them out freehand. Now from black felt, cut two circles for the eyes. For the Easter egg, you can choose whichever colour you like. I'm going to use pink. You can also decorate your egg however you like. If you have extra pieces like I do, attach these using a felt stitch. And then sew the two egg pieces together using a blanket stitch. And add some stuffing to make it 3D. Here is how my Easter egg looks when it's finished. Oh yeah, you also need to attach the eyes and sew on a little mouth. Now thread your needle with white thread and sew on the tail and arms. Remember when we're sewing on the arms that don't sew all the way around, just sew a couple stitches um, kind of right where the elbow should be so that we can put the Easter egg in here. Now take the ear and leg pieces and secure them to the front piece just by using one or two little stitches like this. Um, this is basically just to hold the pieces in place while we sew the two pieces together. Now place the two pieces together and sew all the, way, all the way around the edge using a blanket stitch. Once you have about this much room, stuff your plush and sew up the gap. And once you've done that then we're finished. So as you can see the easter egg kind of sits really nicely in the rabbit's hands like this. Um, you can sew it onto the rabbit as in you could sew the easter egg onto the back or you could sew these little paws onto the easter egg. Um, I would recommend doing this if you want to leave it as a keychain, so I mean if you want to make it into a keychain, but if you want to just leave it as a plush like I am, I think it's quite cute that the easter egg can come out like so because I think the rabbit itself looks cute both ways. So as always, don't forget to leave a video response if you make this plush. And also, if you haven't entered my contest and you want to, I will leave a link to the contest video below. The deadline is on the 1st of April. So thank you for watching. Bye guys. And for those of you that watch till the end, here is some more watercolour paintings. Yay. These are just some I did today and they're of buildings in Morocco. So yeah. <laughs> Bye.